Wikipedia article, Bushism. Bushisms are unconventional statements, phrases, punctuations, possible Freudian slips, malapropisms, as well as semantic or linguistic errors in the public speaking of former President of the United States, George W. Bush. Bushisms, that's so funny. <laughs> Examples. I think we agree. The past is over. <laughs> God, I love yeah. that, man. <laughs> they misunderestimated me. <laughs> now watch this drive. Yeah. Well, yeah, now watch I know the drive. human being and fish can coexist peacefully. <laughs> is he dead? No, he's alive. Look at him. Off his stupid skull. He's literally just a little... He's doing a sexy pose. Did he just... I was about to say, I could have swore you were not going to fucking break that. There's an old saying in Tennessee, and I know it's in Texas, probably in Tennessee, that says, fool me once, shame on, shame on you. Fool me until you, you, you can't get fooled again. <laughs> the, in the punctuations afterwards, the standard proverb is, fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. <laughs> fool me, what was that? Fool me twice, can't get fooled again. <laughs> have you guys ever gone um, onto a porn site and looked up a movie parody? <laughs> I have never been on a porn site in my life. That's a lie. That is a that is a bold faced lie. I swear to God, any porn I need is on Instagram. Then it's a porn site. Any site with porn is a porn. There could be a site with porn on it, but it's not that. Okay, so porn. like, what what about before Instagram's invention? What the hell? Is, like, no way. You've never been on a porn. Site. No. You can find images you want, like elsewhere. Okay, Jimmy. I didn't want to. I didn't want to fully dox him. But... <laughs> oh, you fucking. And then he also embarrassed the shit out of me in like front of this girl I was trying to like uh, get with and like all these other people who I had known for a while. He was oh, you, you told me that story. I got upset for you when you told me that. Yeah, like uh, like I like like me and him were just talking and like I was like and, like he was like like I think like, I forgot who brought it up. But we were talking about like you know how we go so long like because I'm in Lake George for a week and like it's a small cabin so you know it's hard to jerk your gherkin. <laughs> and so he's like he's talking. I was like, oh, right. mean hard, just don't. I'm just sex addict oh, it's yeah. hard not to do this stuff um, well, was, and I was also very I was also a teenager like a young teenager just goon <laughs> just what <laughs> uh, I'm just moving on um, <laughs> and so I, so I told him I was like nah I mean I was like honestly the other day I just like when no one was here like I just jerked off in the shower and then like we're hanging out with um we're hanging out with these girls and everything and you did conversation. What? But just a lot of line of conversation. And then he goes. To be uh, fair, anything goes in the cabin. Yeah, we were just talking, and then like, <laughs> and then like we're, and then we're hanging out with like these girls, and like we're you know, like, and then he's like, oh yeah, like, you know, Colin uh, jerked off in the shower before, and I was just like, why would you blow up your spot? That up? Yeah, he blew up your spot. And then like, I, and then like I said something to him about it, and he got all upset, and he goes back to my, and he's like, oh, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go to the cabin for a second. I'm like, okay. And then I, <laughs> And then I get a call from one of my parents like, hey, why is your friend here all upset without you? I'm like, he's upset. <laughs> Can I go that way? Fuck, where do I go? Into POC. Uh, didn't know that. Like, uh, Smiling Friends doesn't have a publicly released pilot, but there is one. Like, the first episode is not the pilot. Mm. Really? I thought that was. No. There is a, a difference. Do you like, remember when they posted the first episode on like YouTube like a while before? They gave it to Adult Swim and Adult Swim released it just flat out. And like, yeah, but like a while before the show came out, right? A full year. Yeah, okay. So I do, I right, think, uh, alright, so I thought it might have been like a little, because you know, my brain's yeah, I thought fucking that was a, I thought that was the pilot itself. And then it became no, they, they released, because I remember watching it and being like, I've seen this before. Well, they released the first. They released it again later on. The yeah. thing is, a pilot doesn't have to be wholly different. Like it can really? just be slightly changed. Yeah. Really? And sometimes, yeah, the pilot can just be the first. Like episode. that Family Guy. Uh... Yeah. All right. Yeah, that makes sense. Neat. Okay, you done learn some air die. Uh... See that? See, he did it right. He was supposed to fall and just like. See, you're cruel. Because now they have to live like this. I don't think they're living in general. Well, I'm trying to say, like, 
in their hollowed out husks. Maybe they should have thought about that. Be- blah, 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 blah. They should have thought about that before beca- they became hollowed out. I'm just gonna stop talking now. Thank God. Why is Rick Grimes there? When you, when the, uh, when, when you, when you, when you, when, when you, your dreams, when you. Have you ever had a dream that, 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 that you that uh, you could do, uh, you do, uh, you do anything? Um. Would you guys trade? Would you guys switch your the places of your fingers and toes for five million dollars? No. no. How much money would it take you? What about what about three hundred dollars every day? I don't know, man. That's Alternating like... weeks. Uh, so run that by me again. You said so. Where your fingers are, your toes will be. And where your toes are, your fingers will be. This is only going to sound. Is, is this adjusted for inflation as time goes on? Adjusted for inflation. That's a good. That's a good point. Um, because like by like twenty forty seven, I'm not gonna be happy with only getting two million dollars for this. <laughs> that's a good point. Yeah. I love that. I love your rate of inflation <laughs> for twenty years from now. <laughs> the U.S. dollar is gonna be. Equivalent to Zimbabwean fun box. The fucking U.S. dollar will be equivalent to fucking uh, Chuck E. Cheese tokens. I'm gonna have my Dave and Buster's card with a bunch of credits, and people are gonna look at me like I'm fucking the king. Big fucking spender over here. Oh shit. (laughs) Big Dick Colin over here. He got two sloppy things from Dave and Buster's. (laughs) (laughs) You know most families don't even have one. I only got the gecko. You know, got the gecko. I'll check out this frog. You know, Colin, uh, Colin was able to spend most of his Dave and Buster's points because he says he could just buy more credit. You know, there are kids you can't even fucking eat. <laughs> Where will you be during the Pizza Hut Taco Bell wars? <laughs> Wasn't there a Taco Bell movie? No, you're thinking of Demolition Man, or the. Uh... One of the plot points is uh, the fast food wars. Only Taco Bell survived, so every fast yes. food, every, every food place is Taco Bell. I I would still consider. I that remember Taco that Bell. one. Wow. <laughs> I love Demolition Man. I never watched it. Oh my god, we gotta watch Demolition Man. Ugh. When I say is is there? Uh, I heard that they cut they cut the the part that actually explains the fucking three shells joke. Is that like actual footage or is that just lost to? I think it's. I don't, don't think they, they ever explain it, even like written, because the point being is you're supposed to not understand it. No, they filmed it. They filmed the punchline to explain the joke, like explain like it was supposed to be a whole setup, and then they had a scene. Well, I'm glad they didn't supposedly. because that would ruin the joke. The joke is you're supposed to be like, what the fuck do you do with the three seashells? <laughs> I mean, I love whatever. Uh, they, never, what? they, they do never explain it. Yeah, you're right. What's the context? So the point being in the future, there's, there's, there's no, no toilet there's no paper. Toilet paper. Yeah. There's only what is called the three seashells, where it's like three seashell looking things. They so just how sit you where the toilet ass. paper would sit. Yeah, and they the, never explain how like how you're supposed to use it. But and are you guys serious? Yeah, it's an actual. It's an but actual. No, I'm serious that you guys don't know how to use it. <laughs> That's how they would react, and like they wouldn't explain it. Well, they would like kind of like giggle and be like, "He doesn't know about the three seashells." <laughs> But the thing is, in the future, uh, profanity is banned, so every time the main character, like, says a swear, a little, like, fine thing comes out and says, like, you have been fined two dollars for a swear. <laughs> oh, so we're every so time, so close to that. So every time he takes it, he's like, fuck, <laughs> shit. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's just using ass as the toilet paper. I, toilet paper. Oh, I forgot about that. He used that as a toilet paper? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like I said, Demolition Man is fucking great. He just said a bunch of curses, so he started collecting them. He's like, all right, I'll be right back. Walks into the bathroom. <laughs> I think we should I think we should do a recording where we, where, what, where like, uh, we each pick a movie, and then we just watch it. Obviously, we're not going to post us watching the whole movie. We'll just, like... We'll pick the highlights. Uh, isn't that um, Mystery Science Theater 3000? Yeah, but yes. I want to watch Camp Rock. <laughs> it's an incredibly cringy movie, and I wish Mystery Science Theater was around still. I mean, I think they still make new stuff, but Pat Oswald's in it, and I refuse to watch anything he's in. I hate him. I hate him more than anything in this world. You did okay in Rat 2. You hate Raccoon Cooey? You guys didn't see uh, everything everywhere all at once. No, not yet. Okay, you, you, that's a movie you absolutely must. I know. Don't tell me a single word about it. I just turned it. him. I just turned him on. Damn it! 
He's gonna be a problem. You turned it off. Yeah, and uh, accidentally reactivated him. He could have. He could have sat there the entire fucking game. We could have. We could have ignored him the entire. Turned him on. You said. Yeah. Are there the two more useful? I need one, but I want to make sure I get the thing that I want. Uh. It's my life dream. Two o three. To okay. own a virtual boy. Motherfucker. Okay, it's need... possible. Like they make like fully like functional ones that you have, like kind of put together and shit. you you know this right. A virtual boy. You don't know what a virtual boy is. Oh, no, I'm thinking, uh, what's the Fallout one? Oh, Pit Pit boy. Oh, Pit boy? All right, I was close enough. It says boy in it. Yeah, you would. You would. You what, mate? I will not elaborate. All right. 